Hey guys, this is Kate Kennedy and I have something exciting to share with you. This is a new cat club called Felicity Jane. It comes in this adorable black and white striped box. I was so excited when I saw this on the porch. And look how cute this is inside. And I've already kind of messed it up because I took pictures, but I will insert pictures um, to show you what it looked like originally. It was so cute with that black satin ribbon and the little thanks tag. And then inside it has a little crinkly paper. And I love that polka dot tissue paper. Here's a picture of what it really looked like. It was so, so cute. So um, all the products in this kit are exclusive. In other words, you can only get them in the kit. Um, I added the ribbon and the little tag because it goes so perfectly with this kit. I was like, well, those are like extra embellishments. And your papers do come in a big like 13 by 13 um, clear like protective thing so I just wanted to show you that so the first little item that I'm showing you here is a bunch of like a natural twine on a little wooden spool which is really cute and you also get this little muslin bag with the black heart I'm just kind of giving you a general overview here of the embellishments and then I'm gonna get a little bit well I'm starting off with the alphabet so it's a wood wood veneer alphabet I see that there's an ampersand there there's also an at symbol and I think there's an exclamation point and an asterisk and I'm just kind of sifting through here to see like if you get multiples of letters and I did find right off the bat that there's at least two of each vowel there may be more I'm not sure I didn't dig through the whole thing and I also see that there are a set of numbers and I'm not sure if there's more than one number or or what but that's just what I saw in my initial Kind of look through of this so here's a picture of how cute those are and that little muslin bag is so super cute too then there's another little pack of wood veneer and this one says love it and then on the other side there's a selection of hearts and arrows and some tags and this little circle that says best day ever and what i didn't notice when i was showing it in this package is that there's some detail on those um, wood veneers that you'll see in my process video some cute little die cut um pieces gold die cut pieces and then this awesome stencil which says adorable I think this is so fun because you could use this in so many different ways you could completely mask off the center and just use it as a tag shape or you could just use the adorable part or just the scallop part I mean you can it's kind of like a three or four in one stencil depending on which parts you mask off and which parts you use so here's kind of a close-up of what that looks like it's really really cute then there is this set of like printed embellishments and what it, one of the things that is so unique about this is that they're stitched together with a gold stitching and you're gonna see that I actually end up using that in my layout there's there are also shapes that are very 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 easy to cut out if y'all have been watching my videos you know I hate to fussy cut I hate it because I'm not good at it and it just takes a long time but you're also gonna see that I fussy cut all of those in probably like 10 minutes so the last little thing of embellishments I'm going to show you is this cute little like clear pillow box and it's just full of fun things so these little white tags they, they're kind of like office type tags um, this pre-tied little grow grain black bow there's no adhesive on it though um, this little collection of they're not still like confetti like gold confetti because they're not sequins there's a little paper or clothespin that's dipped in gold some gold paper clips and then there are four um, flare buttons. What I love about these flare buttons is that they're tiny. Not super tiny, but tiny. They're the small size ones as opposed to, you know, like the big ones or even the biggest ones that have been coming out lately. So I really like the size of those. And here's just some close-up pictures. It's also a stamp set included in this kit. It's a 4x6 stamp set. Great thing about it, it comes already in an Avery L pocket for you. So if you, that's how you store your stamps, it's great. Lots of fun little images. This would be a perfect thing for Project Life. Um, I love that totes adorbs. I think that is so cute. And then there's kind of like some building ones too where you can kind of mix those flowers together. You can use the little um, vines and leaves together. And then there's a really cute little heart. I love the shape of that heart. Then there's the words life and today which fit inside of that little tab also. So now I'm going to get to the papers, which are probably my favorite part. First, you get a 6x12 piece of vellum, and then these papers are so gorgeous. I love the colors. I love the detail on them. My only complaint about, not complaint, but my only thing is that 
you get one of each and both sides are so awesome. I was like, you'll see in my process video, I was like, oh my God, which side do I use? Which side do I use? Because they're so pretty and I wanted to use all of it. Um, love this black and white heart pattern. So pretty. The One of the things that you're going to see that I really like about this kit is, well, my initial first reaction is that it was very summer, spring kind of color scheme and stuff. But I think that the graphic contrast of the black and white with the pastel colors makes it really cool. I'm obviously talking about something else while I'm doing this video because I'm doing a voiceover now. I'm show, I'm trying to talking about how the shape of that paper is. And I'm, I'm sidetracked real quick. There's a really faint gray line around those arrow shapes. I feel like it makes it a little bit less bold because it kind of makes it blend in instead of there's so there's not so much contrast between the color and the white paper that little bit of gray really helps it kind of um flow I guess is what I'm trying to say and if you saw it in person you probably know what I meant or maybe y'all just think I'm crazy and talking about nonsense anyhow what I was talking about the kit is that I feel like because of the 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 addition of the black and white and then you're going to see with the cardstock because the cardstock is a is the same like hue and colors in the kit but just a shade darker I feel like that kind of makes it transition into like fall especially this paper because it's a great like corally paper and if you just did like the black and white with the coral it could totally be fall um nice fun bright colors I I really enjoyed working with this kit um so here's, the, I'm showing you the front sides and the back sides of the paper. So can you tell which one's the better side? I can't because they're all great. So here are the two pieces of cardstock that also come in the kit. One's like kind of a mustardy color and the other is it's kind of a pinky rust. You can see there when I compare it to the pattern paper, how nicely it blends together without being like the exact same color. So that is the Felicity Jane kit. I believe this kit is called... Charlotte. I'm not first. I'm not completely certain. Um, I'll put a link below to the website and all of the information that you need. It's $34.95 with if you just want to buy one kit, and it's $29.95 with a subscription. And I'm I don't believe that includes shipping, but I'm not positive. Again, you'll just have to check the the website. So I wanted to thank Felicity Jane for sending this kit to me and I had such a great time working with it and I hope y'all check it out. Here's a little sneak of my layout. So stay tuned for the process video. Talk to you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.